Okay, it looks like we are up and running, boys. Welcome to the Sunday stream, which doesn't happen very often, uh, only sometimes. Oh, shit, let me just hold on. Readjust my chair so that it doesn't bump into my microphone. Yeah, this doesn't happen too often. I don't normally stream on Sundays, but yesterday was special occasion. Uh, I had friends over, you know, just how fucking quarantine has finally ended uh, officially for us as well. I mean, it's been, it's ended since like the beginning of May, but now officially it was over. So we got some friends together and, you know, just had a little party, even though the weather was kind of shit. But obviously I was pretty late by the time we were done. I was pretty drunk as well. Uh, now I'm, today I'm very mellow. And not just because I was kind of hungover, but I kind of was. Which is great. It's actually not great, but... What can you do about that, right? Not much. Not much. Uh, we'll see if anybody actually shows up. Again, this is so out of the standard... Uh, modus of operations, the modus operandi, or whatever it's called. I don't know if people will actually come, but if they do, well, I welcome them. Who did I not thank uh, since last time? Uh, Adatron, Adatron I thanked, Andy J Power, who followed, uh, thank you for the follow, and one mister, uh, thank you very much for the follows, boys. Man, we're actually not that far away from 100 followers, which is pretty good. I am proud of that. Six subs. I think Twitch is going well, you know. It's been... You know, it's just been going well. Hey, Forge, what's up? Hello, Dallas. Hello, everyone. Welcome, welcome. So, what are we going to do? Uh... I think that's my dog. She's playing, I think. Uh, yeah, Father's Day. It, today is Father's Day, yeah. Well, we kind of celebrated yesterday with my dad, because he was there as well. Uh, so we had a combined one. Uh, getting treated like a king, that's nice. Well, see, I don't have children, so for me, that's like out of scope so far, you know. But when the day comes, I can definitely, that's my dog, like, she, she's, like, in a good mood uh, today. Maybe because she ate a shit ton of food yesterday, you know, that's the thing about her, like, she really, she'll stare the food out of your mouth, you know, uh, and people cannot resist her, and that leads to her, she's doing very well in any, like, social event. So, yeah. Um, of course, no stream without the dog, right? It would be like, she would be missing at this point if she didn't show up, I think. Uh, so what we're gonna do is we'll take out this boss. And this boss is fairly easy. So we'll, we'll take care of this shit. And then we can, like, move on. Although, will this boss be easy? Hold on. Before I, like... Okay. It's Great Shield versus Great Shield, bitch. Man, the music is... The music is so epic for this guy. But why? This, this guy is not that significant. Holy shit. Oh, he deals lightning damage. Yeah, that's not good. Uh, hey, Aizmo, what's up? Okay. Oh, that doesn't make like a forward shockwave. Why did I think it did? Holy, okay, that's not good. 
So this is like, you know... <laughs> okay. I think we're gonna have to make a bit of a retreat. Um... Yeah, this is like Battle of the Brutes, really. Because I sure as shit can't dodge. He just knocked me off. He just knocked me off. Did you see that little slide I did? Like, it just like went like this. Ouch. It just like proper like slid off. Very nonchalantly. Uh... And that was not good. Wait, that that didn't feel good. Fuck. I was doing pretty well, I think. Um. And you know, wait, hold on. Maybe I did send the elevator back. Was I Galaxy Brain or was I not Galaxy Brain? Yeah, this is again the battle of the big damage boys. Uh, he deals slightly more damage than I do, but maybe, just maybe, I should start using my buffs, right? I feel like at this stage of the game, maybe it would be fucking galaxy brain. I knew it. I knew that I should trust myself. Oh, fuck, why did I put my water so far away? Ah. Uh. I'm gonna do that again because I don't trust myself not to die to this boss. Yeah. Even though, to be fair, that was like more of an unfortunate misstep, you know. Oops, fuck. That was stupid. Ignore that I did that. That didn't happen. Shh, you didn't see anything. I obviously didn't just uh, use an Estus because I thought I was using the Human Pine. I don't know what he's most weak to, honestly. I figured this would work. In general, like a lot of things are weak to Human Pine. Cool. Which is like the Dark Element. Hell yeah, that fat roll dodge. Hello. Hello, Adatron. How are you? Oh, shit. It, it hurts. I mean, he hurts. Oh, did you see the double hit? Hell yeah. That was supposed to be a safety heal. Don't worry. Stay cool. Keep blocking like a bitch. Okay, yeah, that would be a bad idea to get hit by that. Am I gonna get yeeted? Yes, he's trying to. I think he's dead. He's dead. They're still shooting at you, the motherfuckers. How did he get the first and the crown? Listen, I am but a nov novice, novice Twitch streamer. So the inner workings of Twitch elude me. I don't know. But hey, maybe because he was the first follow, it could be. But glad you could join Adatron. Welcome. Welcome, welcome. I don't know, again, listen, although I'm a YouTube expert with Twitch, less so. Uh, so what we're gonna do here, I think, yep, let's kill this motherfucker. Am I gonna have enough? I think so. So yeah, that guy was pretty easy. Um, there are some bosses that I'm kind of dreading, but so far all of them have been just absolute 
bitches. Uh, God, that dragon just... Oh, that's so... He just like straight up disappears. And... It kind of looks awkward, I'm not going to lie. Sorcerer playthrough. That was a good one. I liked that one. And not just because I made it. But partially, partially because I made it as well. Oh shit. Hello Mimic. I straight up didn't know there was a Mimic here. Oh fuck. Thank fuck that somehow avoided me. I it is, right? Yeah. Oh, symbol of avarice, nice. Hey, I got the symbol of avarice. Issue is it drains your HP. Yeah, it drains it quite a bit. Holy shit. Cuz I was going to rock it cuz symbol of avarice is pretty good. Yeah, great sword. That's pretty good. Well, you are the sub king. It's just how it is. But you know, you guys are all first in my heart. It's just how it is. I don't know how to use it either, honestly. I don't have Amazon Prime because we don't have Amazon Prime here. Welcome Hello, Dean. Yep, happy Father's Day to everyone who is a dad. And not in the weird sexual way, in the actual way. Um, <laughs> any baby mama celebrating today? No. Hopefully not. If if there are any celebrating, uh, I don't know about it. I am unaware. So if you're out there, stay where you are, please. I'm only kidding. Hey, I'm No Moth. What's up? Hello, hello. <coughs> Fuck. This is... Uh oh. Yes, plus 10 weapon. I am so happy right now. This just made this playthrough a thousand times better. I am really liking this. Plus 10 weapon. This is going to be. Like, motherfuckers are going to be feeling this weapon. That's the only thing I can say. Uh, oh, I didn't hit the bonfire. Shit, that was stupid. Okay, then we're going here. Just imagine how much easier this guy would have been if I had the plus 10 weapon already, which I could have had. Uh, excuse me, doesn't matter. We are going to go and continue on. Actually, we could go to uh, the other area, the side area. Um, to kill Osiris. Uh, I guess. Yeah, we'll go there. We'll do that. You know, realistically, uh, aside from this stream, I have three more streams to finish this playthrough, honestly. Uh, yeah, it would be like... The fat rolling is pretty much the only uh, kind of artificial difficulty I'm placing on myself because if I didn't have the fat rolling this playthrough would be just like a massacre uh, and I kind of don't want it to be like that holy shit but yeah um, I probably talked about this before but I'm going away on vacation next Saturday I'll, I'll be gone Saturday to the following Friday so a little under a week and one of my goals here is really to kind of finish this playthrough before I go on holiday. Because I don't want to leave you guys hanging, you know. 
But honestly, judging by how we're like steam steamrolling through this, it should be mostly okay. Uh, we'll get a lot done today, hopefully. And then we have DLC and all that left. I'm wondering. Well, I'm going... Uh, I was going to go abroad. Specifically, I was going to go to Italy. Which obviously is something that is not going to work. Uh, but we're going within the country. Originally, I had a holiday booked with friends. Uh, friends and family. But obviously, we had to cancel that one. God, this is a wonderful enemy. Uh, we had to obviously cancel that one. So my parents were gonna go within the country. So I'm just tagging along. Uh, yeah, because people just uh, aren't going... Uh, much. Here we, you are allowed to travel within the country. Like here you're allowed to travel to most places actually. Like pretty much all the neighboring countries have opened their borders. So you can go, but the issue is like rebooking, like Italy is out of the question, obviously. And uh, the other places, uh, like Croatia and like Slovenia and all that, they were booked up so quickly. And the places were so expensive that I was like, fuck no. Like I'm not gonna spend like one and a half times that much that I was originally planning on spending, you know, just to get a place. Uh, so I'm just tagging along with family uh, who, like, they already had their stuff booked. I'm like, I'll go along. At least I'll be out of the... No, not out of the country. I'll be out of the house, you know. We're going to a mountain range, and that's pretty good. If you saw, if you follow me on Instagram... Mr. Underscore Sketchhead, by the way, you can see my last year's vacation from Slovenia, which is also a mountainous place, and that was a great, like, that was amazing, amazing place. And we here in Hungary, we're pretty flat in terms of our country, but we have a couple of mountains, so it's not going to be as good as the Alps, but it's pretty good. Yeah, pretty much everybody's plans have been, like, upended. Um... Again, I had a full holiday booked. Uh, and that was like... But I, I mean, obviously, I got my money back. It was just... I kind of... I felt sorry for the uh, people that we were going to rent the house from. Because it's like a mountainous area of northern Italy. And I really felt sorry for them that... Uh, they're basically losing all their income, you know. Hey, Lumino. And... Hello, Blaring Sea. What's up? What's up, guys? It's going pretty good. I'm doing well. Yup. Gray sword, gray shield. This is a pretty good. Uh, you know why I like this great shield is because it looks. Uh, I like the look of it. That it's not like one of those like square pieces of shit, you know? It's not like an ironing board. Plus, I mean, we are kind of close to a Pursuer cosplay. The armor doesn't match, but... Uh, the armor doesn't match, but whatever. It's okay. You know... That autocorrect, though. So anyways, we'll kill Osiris, I think. I'm not sure if I'll go into the uh, the Dark Fire link for now. I'll, I'll leave that until later, maybe. It's been pretty easy so far. I mean, we did Dragon Slayer armor. And, oh, hello. And that dude, believe me, didn't stand much of a chance. You know, the thing about Gundir is uh, I can just block him, right? Yeah, otherwise he would be, like, fat roll, no shield, he would be difficult. 
But I think just... <laughs> Dragon skill. I almost want to wear this. Uh, I mean, technically... Wait, does, it, does this not give you the hugging ghost? I thought it did. Whatever, this is a piece of shit. I don't want it anymore. I genuinely thought it worked like Gowers. And it gave you the thingy. But whatever. Alright, let's go. This he should be easy as well. Uh, he mostly deals physical damage. God, it looks gross. There's a Bloodborne design coming through, you know. Are Dark Souls remastered and Dark Souls 2 Scholar the first thing worth it? I'd say yeah, definitely. I mean, Dark Souls Remaster is pretty much uh, just a straight-up improvement, and Scholar of the First Sin does a lot of things differently, you know. So, I'd say yeah, definitely. Gross hands, too. Yeah, this game is pre pretty Bloodborne-y. Definitely try the first two. Yeah, Scholar is super different from Vanilla. Uh arguable whether better or not uh, story-wise definitely better some of the enemy like replacements are oh fuck god you have a lot of HP is he freaking out already? How did I not... Did you see that? That was... I'm actually the luckiest person on earth. Like, how did I not get hit by that? Okay, he's gonna charge. Yup, okay. <laughs> yeah. The thing is... Oh shit, okay. Wonky. Just heal, bitch. That just like straight up has a hurt box on his whole body. Janky janky, but it's all good. He's dead. That was um Yep, <laughs> so much it's disgusting damage, you're right. Yep. Listen. That was that was a tough fight. That came down to the wire. I don't know how I don't know if you saw, but that was pretty it was pretty difficult. Um I broke a sweat. Man, I kinda like playing like this. Sometimes it's fun to just, you know, bust through the entire game. Too easy. Yep, yep. Yeah. We were just talking about this earlier. <laughs> yeah. Get good, Osiris. That if I wasn't fat rolling, this would be just like a massacre. Uh, it's like the only... A uh, little artificial difficulty thing I can place on myself. Okay, so we'll hit this bonfire. I'm not going to do untended graves just yet because I don't feel like it. We'll do this later. Uh, we'll go back to Firelink to level up. Yeah, I remember even like on my very first playthrough, like unintentionally I ended up using a greatsword 
not an ultra, but I was using the pontiff uh, thingy. I know, I know. I'm working on the emotes. Yeah, profane greatsword. Uh, and that was a good weapon as well. It ended up making the game fairly non-challenging. I like that weapon, yeah, yeah. Okay, I don't know, I just felt like leveling up even more. Uh, we're getting up there, guys. Exactly. I think I've decided that I'm not gonna fuck with the Dragon Bone Smasher or whatever Fume Ultra because I don't care about it. This is powerful enough. And we have the Pursuer cosplay. So what do we have? Do we need anything from here? Uh, Yorm's, Yorm's Great Shield. How do you guys feel about Yorm's Great Shield? Fuck it, I'll get it. Uh, just as a... Just in case. Oh shit. <laughs> yeah, okay. I got the message game. I have Havel's Ring, yeah, yeah, yeah. I was like, I need to get that for sure. So we'll use a couple of these that we don't need. Because honestly, I will need just a little bit more uh, vitality. Because. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I always forget this. You're right. I'll keep these two around, and I'll keep a couple of these. Uh, ju just in case, you know, we need something else. So get a couple of more points of vitality. But HP is too tempting. Uh, the only reason I'm doing this is because it's nice to have a bit more uh, just kind of ability to vary your armor if you want to. The other thing I wanted... Okay, you're out of embers. Shit. But, I will clean out your human pine and your gold, gold pine. Cool. Let's go. Uh, fuck. Okay. Listen, I'm really absent-minded. I picked up an Estus shard. But I didn't forget. Hell yeah. Oh, they're on sale? Okay, that's cool. It's They're worth getting for sure. 100% uh, Scholar and the other one. Okay. Oh yeah, and I didn't hit the bonfire because I was stupid. I was, yes. But I I abandoned the meme. You know, like the meme potential, I guess. But I'll go back and get it. I'll go I'll go get the onion armor because I can get it uh, in Yorn's boss room just to have it stocked up. I'll move to the next bonfire because we haven't we haven't made progress in like five minutes because I was just fucking running around the firelink shrine. Uh, but yeah, after that, definitely. I guess so, yeah. It's a classic setup, isn't it? Yeah, a lot of wannabes in this town. And by this town, I mean Dark Souls 3. I 
Okay, this time I'm not gonna send the elevator back because I think I have low chances of dying. We're gonna see some top tier bonfire placement here, guys. You know about this. Eight tier bonfire placement. I think they pretty much did, didn't they? Or fan service. Fan service and running out of ideas are not that far away from each other, I think. Anyways, Gotthard. Poor Gotthard, man. Yeah, and you can see the like you can see the Dragon Slayer bonfire from this bonfire. I think this must have been like an oversight. You know, like the leading theory is that initially they were gonna have uh, no bonfires spawn from bosses, but later decided to add it. And that's why, ouch. That's why it's kind of fucked up like that. Ah, fuck. Oh, yeah? You wanna go, bitch? Didn't think so. Man, this weapon is satisfying to use. Even in even in the fan service game, you know, Dark Souls 2 is just like the bastard love child. Unfortunately. What up? 669? Yeah. Talk about pretty good damage. Pretty much like one-shotting everything. Uh... Sorry, bruh. Sorry, bruh. Okay, you have more HP. 749. Orphan? Orphan, yeah. Uh, Orphan of Cause, I think, is pretty much the... I would argue it's the hardest boss in the series. Um... I don't think it gets any harder than Orphan of Cause, honestly. I mean, the most obvious Bloodborne reference is probably a. Oh shit! That teleport. Damn, all these motherfuckers teleported out. And I don't give a shit that they did. <laughs> it's like, I, I was thinking about uh, quitting and reloading, but... No thanks. I don't think so. Yeah, the ones with the candles have more HP. Yeah, I mean, Demon Souls Remastered is the one that's going to be taking the spot. And they confirmed that it's a launch game, right? For PS5. Right? I'm hoping they did. Oh, what the? Oh, okay. There was an enemy there. I was like, how am I, how am I getting hit by all this magic? Well, I wasn't. Oh, fuck. Okay, chill it with the damage. It's 
It's not gonna be 600 pounds for sure. Uh, it's 100% not gonna be 600 pounds. It's gonna be like 400 max. Believe me. It looks alright, honestly. I'm not the biggest fan of the look, but... As people have pointed out, it looks a little bit like a router. Uh, but it's whatever, I mean... Or it looks like the, the robots from Portal, you know, that shoot at you. But it's okay, I mean... It's not the thing that counts, right? Oh, can I kill him? Oh, shit. It's possible to kill him. Yeah, it does. Yeah, like the Portal 2 turret. Exactly. That's the one. Oh, oh, that's a lot of damage. How did I suddenly take that much damage? Yeah, item burden needs to go from Demon Souls. As well as oh fuck. Okay, I'm out of I'm out of the thingy. As well as the character tendency, world tendency mechanic needs like a major overhaul. Other than that, good to go. But the thing is that it's a remake of Demon Souls, so it's not a remaster, which means there are gonna be uh, gameplay changes, like major gameplay changes, which is what it needs, that game, honestly. I'm just hoping they can deliver. Listen, the Dark Souls remake was good. But... Yeah, Demon Souls needs a bigger overhaul. Yeah, it's so complicated. The thing about the... If you've never played Demon Souls, it's an awesome game. Like, truly awesome. Like, you can very much tell... Uh, like, how many of the... Oh, I have 76,000 souls. Eh, we can risk it. Yeah, so... The issue with Demon Souls is you either gotta use an emulator, and for that you need a fairly powerful PC. Or you need to dig out your PS3. But the thing I was gonna say is that it's awesome. Like, Demon Souls is <clears throat> really good. Outside of a few things. You know, like, if you play Demon Souls, you can definitely tell that they were kind of just, like, testing a lot of ideas. Uh, it has a great story, great environments. Uh, but you can definitely tell that they were testing a lot of the ideas. And you can definitely tell why some of the ideas didn't make it over to Dark Souls. Uh, like, some of the ideas are just... they just don't work. Uh, but a lot of them do, you know. And it's fun to kind of play the proto Soul Series game, even though you could say that, you know, like Kingsfield and all that are the true origins. But yeah, it's a clunky game, like honestly, it's clunky, and if you go back and play it, you'll find that it's way too easy. Like, if you've trained yourself on any of the other Souls games, or like you've completed any of the other Souls games, Demon Souls is gonna be a cakewalk, except for a few areas. And the issue is really that the areas that are difficult are difficult because they're annoying instead of being actually challenging. But that's the thing, you know, the remaster is a perfect opportunity to fix all that. Okay, I need to start blocking. Yeah, bitch, broke your poise. 
Yeah. I mean, I don't think they're going to make it too bright. But... I don't know. And that that's the other thing. Like, if you go back to... Demon Souls, it kind of looks shitty, honestly. Like, it's a it's an old game. It's an eleven year old game, so it's like, you know, if they like stick to this type of visual, uh, like I like the visual of this game, honestly. Say what you will about the actual gameplay, but. Like this type of visual aesthetic. Oh fuck. General like visual aesthetic. I'm okay with. Okay, I'm gonna get fucked by these two. Cause I'm way too slow. Yeah, it's Dark Souls 2 that's the odd one out. Really. Wondering if that guy is ever going to release his Dark Souls 2 mod where he's working on fixing... What the fuck are you doing, camera? Oh, where is he? Oh, there you are. I'm like, what the hell? It's nice that I don't even have to like give a shit about how much damage I'm taking. Yeah, they gotta find like a balance between all the visual styles. But, like again, if they have like the style of Dark Souls remastered, I'll be okay with that. Listen, Demon Souls is coming out, really. I'm willing to excuse a lot of things. Um So that's how it's going to be. Okay, now we got this NPC fight. I am very much hoping that this is going to be a steamroll. Oh yeah. Want to see a strength weapon? I'll show you a real strength weapon. Get on my level. <laughs> this is how you take care of gangs in this game. You wanna go? That would be cool, yeah. If they added like some like arena, uh, that would be really good. Because Demon Souls had fun PV, fun but broken PvP, really. Uh, the issue was that I've talked about this before, but again, to anyone who is not familiar with Demon Souls, the issue with Demon Souls was that you pretty much had three healing items that. Uh, basically healed you to full or like healed a like an extremely high amount of HP and it was incredibly easy to farm up 99 of all of those healing items um, and then just like I think what what would work uh, for the healing system and this is just you know sketch head uh, game design here is if they only let you carry three types of healing and oh shit okay so only three types of healing items and you could only carry like I don't know like 20 of each not even 20 I don't know how many like 10 of each let's say just you know again I'm sh just shooting shit off the top of my head uh, you, you can choose three and you can carry 10 of each. So you have like 30 healing items. 
uh yeah I'll make it like bloodborne that's what i would say but you know just to keep the different types uh that would be uh you could keep some balance like that that you could take all your like uh full moon grass and new moon grass and whatever but the risk there is that even if you get damage for like a tenth of your hp you have to use one of those or you could take a combination of lesser healing items and the strong ones but then the balance would be that you might not have a lot of full heals available. I think that would be something that's good. That could be a thing just... Oh, fuck. Oh, this is my least favorite thing when this happens. Doesn't matter. Or I could just make it like Estus. Yeah. I feel like I feel like the the grass system, you know, like you cosplaying as a stoner works. Uh needs a bit of tweaking. Tweaking. Speaking of tweaking, you know, that character in Demon Souls sure is tweaking. That's what it is. I was watching a video about... I don't know if you guys know Rare Earth. Uh, if you don't know Rare Earth, you should check it out. It's probably one of my favorite YouTube channels currently. And they made a video about... Uh, I think in Sudan. They have this drug called Cat. K-H-A-T. Which is like this leaf you chew. And it's a little bit like... Uh, it's a bit cocaine-ish. And that's what I imagine the Demon Souls grass is like. Yeah, I've played Hollow Knight. I actually have a full playthrough of the game on my YouTube. Recently, too, I played it. What up? Okay, you're still... Okay, okay. Ouch, 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 ouch. These spinning motherfuckers, I swear. Oh man, these guys are annoying. Oh fuck, there's four... I realize that I don't really care about this item. No, actually I should, right? There's something important up there. Yeah, for Hollow Knight... Oh fuck, I didn't know he could come through here. This is such a ridiculous enemy. Fuck, I had my thing. I had my R1 queued up. So I'm playing a second playthrough of Hollow Knight. Sometimes I play it. Uh, I'm going for the other ending. The good ending. Bath salts, yeah. That's New Moon Grass. That's the bath salts. <sighs> Where the fuck do I have a shard from? Bruh. Okay. For Hollow Knight, or... I don't think you can, can you? What level is the GS? Plus 10. Plus 10 it is. Bath salts. <laughs> We're stupid. And even though it's like a... Oh, you can? Yeah, I don't know. Oh, it's can't you get? It's not a question. It's a, Yeah, I got you. I didn't know. But I wanted to make a different character and try like a, a spell build, you know? It's a really good game. Shield is base. Uh, I, should, I should reinforce the shield as well. 
What does this shield take actually? Uh, probably tight night scale, yeah. But I have a lot of those. <coughs> Excuse me. Actually, actually. Why not, right? I don't know, yeah, kinda. You know, the the reason I can replay it a uh, second time is because it's a little bit different uh, doing a YouTube playthrough type deal and just playing the game on your own. You know, with, with YouTube, you know, I still have a feeling... Uh, less so when I'm streaming, but when I'm doing like proper YouTube videos, I have an urge to just like make progress, you know? So I tend to just like not fuck around and explore everything. When <coughs> I'm playing on my own, I can. I've been playing OSRS. What's OSRS? I'll take mobile game rec recommendations if you have them. Okay. Gotta be like really on point. So did I manage to kill that thing? I don't think I did, but I don't care. Oh shit, you're right. See, because I was just about to mention... Oh, old school runes... It's on mobile? Uh-oh, that would be bad. Because I kind of like runescape. Shit. Well... That sounds pretty good. I'm mean, just like, look at this, these guys... Speaking of Demon Souls references we were discussing earlier, uh, this is all a Demon Souls reference. This entire area. Holy shit, I didn't know that existed. Why did I not know that exists? Okay, Big Knight. Come on, Big Knight. There you go. Oh yeah, bitch. I never seen a shield like this. Yeah, the fact that they even have red eyes for the, for these Lothric knights. The other ones don't even have them. How are you still alive? As in, there was no way this fool would be able to block my fucking chad ass greatsword with that wooden shield or whatever. We know they're cheating. What up? Come on. Holy shit. <laughs> Alright, you're gonna have a bad day. Told you. Oh, damn. Wow, that's... Okay, I'm gonna have to be careful here. Just because of the damage they deal. But what about the damage I deal? What about that? Yeah, it's super. The game is super fun like that. Holy shit! I'm gonna. I'm definitely gonna download that. Um, because RuneScape, you know. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry about the coughs. It's not COVID. Don't worry. It's just I was. Um, Shouting, 
yesterday. Well, I was shouting, but you know, again, we had like 10 people over, so the level of volume needed to speak was higher than normal. You know how it is. Okay, I think I think I'm not going to need this. I will use human pine. Yeah, Dark Souls is uh, yeah, again, it's the odd one out. Um in terms of everything, you know. Including the looks. But it's cool, it's a cool game. I'm looking forward to probably doing Dark Souls 2 as well later. I'm planning on getting it for PC so that I can download the mod. Uh, again, it has a mod similar to... Oops, I just knocked into my mic. Similar to Daughters of Ash. Okay, you just walk past. I don't know how this is gonna go. Uh, I mean, I have the curse ward. I guess you can, no, you can block these guys pretty easily. The issue is... Uh, the issue is that this shield doesn't have a very good fire defense rating. There's gonna be like some Chad Gray sort of action here. This is a nice, nice cutscene though. Another dogged contender. Welcome, unkindled one. Purloiner of cinders. Mind you, the mantle of Lord interests me. We gotta watch this. Have I soloed all the bosses before? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Exactly, if they called it something different. Swords and sorceries. <laughs> exactly. Just be beating up two crippled dudes. God, you're an asshole in this game. Okay, you can still dodge. Definitely. Oh, oh. Houston, we have a problem. And that problem is... Dodging that attack. Thank you for letting me heal. Listen, this is like a slap fest for sure. Uh, that's kind of how I expected this to go. Listen, I just gotta outlast them with Estus. Told you. As long as I have more Estes than these bitches, it's gonna be easy. Easy money. <laughs> Probably, yeah. Oh yeah, because it's a magic attack. You're right. That's not a fire attack he does. Bad touch, bad touch alert. You know both of these dudes probably smell like shit too. Like definitely. And just look at him. This is, this is an, it's a neckbeard nest. This is what this throne room is. If you haven't seen, I urge I urge you guys to check out reddit.com slash r slash neckbeard nests. Ma it makes for pretty good entertainment. Oh yeah, okay. 
Can I hit both of them? Oh, what happens if I block? Ah, uh, okay. Probably should have blocked a bit more. Okay. I am armed with a lot more knowledge now. Knowledge. So, yeah, just block. That's, wh that's what I'm gonna do. These dudes and their neckbeard nest. I have a bone shard. But it doesn't even matter. I'll use it because I have a lot of HP, but later it can wait. Yep. Now I can use to you may rest here too. That's a pretty good line. Their their lines are good. You have to admit. I have nothing that I can use to make myself even more powerful. Listen, I like this boss. Honestly. I like them. Music is epic. Fight is pretty epic. You may rest here too if you like. Okay, let's go for one attack only. Stamina recover. Yeah, okay, this is this is bad. This is the Fuck. Hmm. I'm sure you can dodge it. Like that's not the it's not the issue. But sometimes I'm wondering, like they would do, change to fast roll. I'm holding out, you know, again. The fat rolling is the one restriction I have on myself. So I'm holding out, not changing to fast roll. But if it like really gets impossible, uh, which I have kind of a suspicion that in the DLC, it's going to get impossible, like... I just don't see how you could possibly beat Freed fat rolling, but I don't know. Maybe you can. If we get there, uh, we'll see. We'll see. Hey, you have to wait for every single time for these dudes to pass. It's like yielding to traffic, you know. Yeah, probably not impossible. I don't know. What happens if you gold pine resin? We'll try gold pine. I don't know why, because I feel like using gold pine instead. Okay, this deals 420, dank. Oh, fuck. This is far away in this time. See that you can dodge. So you can strafe him sometimes. It's 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 literally impossible to dodge it. Uh, 
I did it the last. Yeah. Random thing popped into my mind. Anyone watching Dora Hedoro? I have never heard of it. Future Man? I haven't heard of these shows. It's a manga, okay. Tells the story of an amnesic reptilian had it came and working together with Holy shit. Okay. That sounds interesting, Goo. Uh so here's the thing, boys. I think it's actually impossible to dodge that attack uh if you're fat rolling. Um Which is pretty weird, because, I mean, they, they like didn't consider that you would play as someone who fat rolls, right? Gotta be a real motherfucker to play a fat rolling character. Holy shit, okay. Uh, I don't know. Should I break my own rules? I heard Jojo is really good, but I never got around to playing it. Not playing it, what am I talking about? Watching it. I'm stoned again. <sighs> I'm not breaking my own rule set just yet. Fast roll? W one, one last attempt. Fuck, okay, I'm stupid. I just wasted a stus. A stus flask. Oh, it's possible. Man, your timing's gotta be like real on point for it, though. Shit. Oh, come on, I thought it was gonna stagger. Whatever. God, this... this section. These neck beard nest motherfuckers. Okay, that missed. I'm so lucky. I think he's dead, right? There's no way he's not dead. Yep, he is. Cool. It's possible to do it. What? Okay, you're talking about lizards and all that? Yeah, keep fat rolling, I think. 
Sorcerers are the ruling class. That's pretty good sounding. On Netflix too. Maybe I'll watch it. I'll watch it. I'll check it out. Why not? Right? Cool. So it's possible to do this. Uh, it's even possible to dodge. I would have thought, honestly. Um, Because I'm pretty sure they wouldn't have such an oversight, you know, that it's not possible to dodge an attack. All right. So before I place all that shit. We gotta level up and we gotta go to the untended graves. That's our next destination. <coughs> Use the bone shard. I mean, I pretty much got nothing to spend these souls on stat-wise, aside from HP and stamina. Which you can never have enough of. So I'll go here, take care of... Oh yeah, shit. I forgot, I need to pick up the Onion Bro armor. Weebs. Yeah. Listen. If you're against anime, you gotta come talk to my body pillow about that. Me and my body pillow would like to have a word with you. Oh, the caps. <laughs> Nightbot. Apparently Nightbot likes anime. I knew it. I knew that motherfucker was an anime watcher. I could tell. I knew it. Like... Why wouldn't he be an anime fan? He was like, not gonna let you disrespect my anime. Banhammer. How I do it, you know. You guys are learning some secrets about me. Is she gonna? Oh no, she's not gonna invite because I killed her, didn't I? Oh no, she does. Oh, this is a different one to the other chick. She's gonna have a bad time. It's using the rapier. <laughs> See, this is why mental images are strong, you know. Yeah, I'd like to go to Japan for sure. Aside from, you know, like, outside of weebing, it just seems like a cool place. Um, yeah. 
it's pretty much all I can say about that, but right now, obviously, that ain't happening. But it will happen, for sure. Oh, you studied there as well? Okay, that's cool. I'm going to use this, because I feel like using it. I can do whatever the hell I want. Uh, we'll use charcoal. Why not? I should stock up on this. What a bitch. You ain't even have a shield with you. Idiot. Got the Mortal Kombat kicks though. Oh yeah, this is... This dude is gonna have a bad time, I think. Oh, that's an actual grab. That's an actual grab. I've never seen that. Holy shit. Huh. Okay, well at least we got to see that. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's a... Uh, Tokyo and Kyoto. Ooh. <laughs> hey, I was in the States as well. States gang. Uh, I'll just run. So yeah, that was a little bit... I forgot he had a command grab. Unblockable mid command grab. That's a, that's a really good animation though. I gotta give it up. He's like grabs you and stabs you. Grabs and stabs. Bitch. I'm gonna command grab me. You guys see how little like stamina damage he's doing with that shit? This dude is, again, he's gonna have a bad time. Uh oh. I'm gonna have a bad time. He got me on wake up. Bringing out all the fighting game terminology here. Shit! This guy is so much easier when you just dodge him. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. He's fast, that's the issue. This is why I'm dreading the DLC bosses. Because those motherfuckers talk about fast. I'm using humanity like an idiot. I shouldn't really. Uh, Texas eluded me as well. Never been. So a bit too far away, you know. Oh shit, I was just about to walk off the cliff, I think. That would have been pretty bad. So how about we just do this normally, this fight? I'm thinking you could make this guy into a decent fighting game character. Like he has all the moves. You know, command grab, dash attack, weapon. Put this guy into MK. I and mean, MK has enough guest characters as is. What's one more gonna do? 
Yeah, bitch. Avoided your shit now. Oh, yeah. Fuck. He got me with the command grab. Man, he knows how to... Shit! I hate that it gets you on wake up. Worth it. Man, this guy sucks like this. He's so much easier. Well, luckily, I am the supreme Estus user. As in, I have so many fucking Estus flags that he doesn't stand a chance. Just hit him. Come, just hit him. There we go. easy but man that boss sucked like that because he's <coughs> he stuns you for such a long time like his and all of his attacks like you couldn't just like let thank you thank you you couldn't just like let go of block to charge your stamina back because it kept you stunned but again in a problem okay thank you for not working Come on, backstab. Don't be a bitch. This is where all the useful shit is. Like, literally, where all the useful shit is. It's pretty cool. She's just like straight up here. I'm buying that. Uh, rest of this, we can buy them normally. So it's like, who cares, really? What we got? Two blueberries. Nice. Gotta get that vitamin C, you know, into your system. Yeah, them blueberries, though. Gotta get that ending. That good ending. Cool, I think we got everything. Uh, we use our brand new coiled sword to get back to the Firelink Shrine. Nice. It's all. It's all we got. Gotta hand over the blueberries. 
Ocean one. Are these... Are these eyes? She likes them. This is like the only good piece of dialogue in this game. It is forbidden. These were revealed through a sliver of light, frightful images of betrayal. A world without fire. Ashen one, is this truly thy wish? Of course. I serve thee and will do as thou bidst. This will be our private affair. No one else may know. That's why I like that's why I listen to this. Stay thy path. Find lords to link the fire. And I will blindly tend to the flame. Until the day of thy grand betrayal. Cool. Very well. Then touch take me. So anyways, I'm gonna pump up my HP. So about them lords, we got them motherfuckers right here. Yep, you know how it is. <sighs> whatever, don't care about this dude. He has a quest line, but it's like whatever. Alright Forge, thank you very much for stopping by man. Forge slash fry. Hope you enjoy the stream. And this is where he says new things, if I remember correctly. Maybe not. Huh. Weird. It don't matter. Last place, Lothric. Oh, what up? I didn't even talk to this dude. <laughs> Whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay, thanks. We got it. Pillage Embers. Why did he turn like that? God, his head looks creepy. Yup, most worthy. Let's do this. Don't should I do Soul of Cinder? Or I can do we can start the DLCs. Right, DLC one. Why not? His head is just burning. Okay. And that's all that that produces. It's what we've been working for up until now.
Yeah, this is a cool scene. Especially if you're wearing badass armor. <coughs> if you're a naked weirdo, which a lot of people play the game as naked weirdos, it's a little bit less cool, but still. Got them kilns. This is a nice looking area too. And of course we have this bonfire, the supreme bonfire. All right, I haven't forgotten. We'll stop by in Irithyll dungeon to pick up the onion armor. I don't even know if I'll be able to even wield it or if it's too heavy, but I did not forget. We'll check it out. I mean, even the helmet would be enough. Oh, it's like way heavier. Yeah. It's too heavy. That's the issue. Still too heavy. Okay. See, I'm only wearing the... I mean... Let's put a shirt on, bitch. Uh, I'm not quite sure about this outfit just yet. See, if I did the cutscene in this outfit, that would have been a lot less cool. I think we'll stick with the night stuff. I'll keep pumping up my uh, vitality too, if I don't forget. Well, we got it. Alright, DLC numero uno time. I'm oh, yawning a lot, I don't know why. Probably because I was up super late yesterday. Of course, we'll accept. Better than having Manus's hand fondle you, right? That's what I'd say. Exactly. 
what he said. So this should be decently easy for the first part, um, I think. I mean, this build is this build. What up? Yeah. Gross hand, the teeth hand. That's disgusting. But Manus can't help it. He ain't exactly the prettiest. <laughs> it's always like that, isn't it? Yeah. And that's something that works cross species as well. Like... If I yawn, my dog starts yawning too. Seriously. It's like a demonstrated thing. Yeah, I am just like brute forcing this. They have very good shields though. Okay, what the hell was that? A projectile from somewhere. Was that you? No, that was him. You see that strafe? It's a fair and balanced weapon, right? Yeah, it's just a weird thing. Cox. <laughs> it's such a weird thing when the backstab doesn't work. Is it? So I think this is the less annoying part of it. And is where it gets r r to be like a real pain in the ass. But that's just how it is, you know. Man, it's... you cannot st stealth past these wolves, can you? That would be cool, if you could. Alright then, let's get it over with. You'll have a bad time. Because I have a great shield. Told you. Great shield versus doggo, I think great shield is the winner. No, don't kick, idiot. Okay. Did you see? Did you see that? That's just like it's quite an attack. Snow areas are nice, especially since you know Souls does not actually have that many snow areas. I'd rather take 10 snow areas than a fucking uh, lava area like Ulasil. Not, not Ulasil, Isolith. What am I talking about? Okay. Speaking of annoying enemies, you're looking at some. 
How many of them are there here? There's a lot more of them than I remember. Sorry, Wolfo. My bad, my bad. And there's a lot of weird enemies in this town. But, Greatsword is um, dominating the scene, as always. Okay, that one is not alive. Oh, that one is. Them three ladies are having a bad day. Yeah, this is what I really like about this playthrough. Uh, is that I can just like kind of force my way through everything. Hopefully it's gonna be a snow area pog. I'd really like that. With giants. Because the last area, the missing Ariston is supposed to be the land of giants. And that's like... That would be my shit, honestly. I what's the point of this bonfire? I I know what it is. It's that you don't have to run through the bridge every single time, right? Whatever. Can't believe I just figured that out now. Oh man, Freed. Freed is gonna be something else. Well, you look to be unkindled. That voice, though. No bell tolls. And yet you've slipped into the painting. Oh, no matter. If you've lost your way. The words of Lady Frida will guide you. Now go on inside, show respect, and listen carefully. Badass. I, I really like his voice. Hey, a bonfire. Named. Yeah, okay. Your your dialogue I don't give a shit about. I'm already dreading fighting you. Uh We'll go up. We'll talk to the girl. She doesn't say much, does she? Oh wait, no, she's not even around. Yeah, I forgot. Uh yeah. Freed, freed, freed. Yep. Who's... Like, it's everybody's favorite fight, isn't it? Okay, I'm gonna go across again. Because I finally figured out the point of that bonfire. Shit. Yeah, because I used to like come across the bridge every single time, but that's a bit pointless. Okay, I know it's a bit early, I was gonna go the full two hours, but we made a lot of good progress. I think this is like a perfect place to stop, uh, which is exactly what I'm going to do. I'll wrap it up here, and then we'll continue on Tuesday. Tuesday. Continue on Tuesday from here. We'll get DLC 1 done. Uh, Thursday, DLC 2. 
And then Friday, if I don't finish, we'll finish the rest of the game. All right. Peace out, guys. It's been nice talking to you. Thank you for watching. It's been cool chatting. And yeah, I hope to catch you guys Tuesday as well. Peace out. See you.